Okay, so basically I really like these type of shows. There's something about them that is uh, just ill. You know what I'm saying? Like, I guess the drama of surgeries and you know, maybe my fascination with gore and you know, uh, they're always opening up somebody's body and they're always, you know, delving into the psychological aspect of these surgeries, the mortality. Everything about them. If you don't, if you don't watch, or you've never watched medical shows, TV shows, I'm not talking about, you know, like I'm talking about acting, like actual drama series shows. Um, I started watching The Resident. It's really fucking dope. Um, one of my favorites is Chicago Med. Um, another one I just started, New Amsterdam. That's got the dude that died that was on Blacklist. Egghead, I think his name is, Ryan Eggfold, or whatever the fuck. But yeah, in general, medical shows, man, they're just very dramatic. They show all these characters. They let you see behind the scenes of the whole hospital business. It's kind of crazy when you watch these shows, and then you maybe you're not aware of how hospitals are all, they're always making these decisions based on fucking money. You know what I mean? Like, based on whether or not you can make the hospital money. It's kind of crazy when you think about it. They show you how these doctors, surgeons are getting older and their hands are shaking. It's just very, uh, very dope, man. I like it a lot. I suggest you uh, check out one of them shows. The three that I'll recommend off the top of my head is uh, The Resident, which I just started. It's very dope. I've been watching Chicago Med. That shit's just... See, it's not only just the, the content and subject matter. The acting is really great. Um, Dick Wolf, who's one of the, he does Chicago Fire, Chicago Med, and Chicago PD. He's incredible, you know what I mean? Like, uh, the way that he, uh, directs and produces, shit is just fire. Notice the ovation guitar in the background, know what I mean? The view, that's my office view, just so y'all get a good idea of what shit looks like when I'm working. I don't know, let's see, uh, if you can get a good view out the window to put the shit right up to it. I don't know how that's looking, but yeah. But basically, man, definitely, man, medical TV shows are fucking flavor. If you know, because it's crazy, because I just went and watched the new Liam Neeson movie and the shit sucked. And you would think Liam Neeson doing a revenge movie is going to be better than a show, you know, that's just a medical hospital show. But yo, man, it just, in all movies and drama and fucking TV, Everything is all about how, how dope shit is written, how dope the actors are acting, and how they build some uh, suspense from episode to episode, man. And movies are just lacking these days, man. Movies don't got it. Man, I just don't see movies being... It, it's part of the whole system of how, uh, you know, um, there used to be very few cable networks back in the day and way more movie companies. And then all the movie companies, everything got consolidated to just a couple of these companies and then tons of TV companies. And that, so there's more competition, you know what I mean? So HBO's competing with Showtime more now, with AMC, with this and that, you know what I'm saying? And so it forces people to really fucking bring it. Plus think about it, what would you rather do if you were an actor, be on one movie that you get paid once for two hours or be on a series that could last for nine fucking seasons? So, you know what I mean? It's crazy, bro. You know, and listen, I watch other shit, but right now I just wanted to drop. I was watching The Resident right now, and I was like, this shit is so flavor. How do I even describe it? You know, I can't really go through each episode. You got to just watch the shit for yourself. But, you know, um, I've also had my experience being in the hospital many times because of Mom Dukes and surgery she had and all that. And, you know, so... You know, it, 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 it's cool to, when, when, you know, you see a narrative that's giving you a lot of behind the scenes to what the, these people are dealing with. And I just want to end this off with, I got a lot of respect for any of you, whether you're a nurse, whether you're a doctor, whether you're, you know, uh, an orderly or whatever, anybody that really helps other people in that vein, I, I got mad respect for you. You know what I'm saying? Because that's something that I, I don't do. You know what I mean? I decided to become a rapper. But, you know, you, 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 you decided to do, focus your life on helping people, and I salute that. Much respect.